Welcome to the world of football. The dispute between Paul Pogba and his brother Matthias was one of the most surprising stories of the summer, and it still continues. The Juventus midfielder is at the center of a case of attempted extortion by an organized gang involving Pogba. Pogba complained to the French authorities that he was detained by hooded men and childhood friends who demanded 13 million euros from him. He is believed to have been threatened multiple times, and one of the gang members is his brother Matthias, as the gang suggested, even though he was visited at the Juventus training center. Pogba hired medicine men for charity. Additionally, it was reported that Pogba had even hired a sorcerer, and Matthias claims it was done to charm the French international and Pogba's teammate Kylian Mbapp. Pogba offered to pay the gang members 100,000 euros, but they refused, saying they wanted 13 million euros from him, and continued their blackmail attempts. The gang visited Pogba several times, including one in Manchester in April and another at Juventus training ground in July, after which the player decided to take legal action. It has now been revealed that Pogba paid a sorcerer, but not to harm Bap. Instead, he wanted help for a children's charity he supported in Africa. Pogba now believes that his brother is acting on behalf of the gang members, France Info said, and that he has been under heavy pressure from them. If you are new and haven't subscribed, please do and turn on the notification button. Previously, Matthias talked about the situation. It's not about money. You got me involved in spite of myself. I almost died because of you, you left me in the hole, while you were running away, and you want to be innocent, after all, people will see that you don't. There is a no coward, traitor and hypocrite greater than you on this earth. Killian, do you understand now? I have nothing negative against you, my words are for your good, everything is tried and true, the sorcerer is known. Sorry for this brother, a so-called Muslim immersed in witchcraft. It's never nice to have a hypocrite and a traitor near you. It remains to be seen how far this case will go, but for now the investigation is ongoing, and more will be revealed in the coming weeks.